I'm heading to the gym. Thankfully, I have not been, I've been to the gym twice in the last six days. Today's day number six. So I'm ready to get there. Today, I'm going to go ahead and hit some legs um, and probably throw in some shoulders and arms in between, kind of get a full body workout in. Like I said, I've not worked out. So I'm really excited to get in the gym. I'm probably gonna be there for at least a good like hour and a half, maybe even two hours. Might even do like 10 minutes of cardio. Just kind of get my body back in sync. I did have lemon water this morning, which is really good for digestive health and pH balance and stuff. So that felt really good. It felt good to kind of like, even if it was mentally just like detox, I don't know. But I'm heading to Lyft now. I'm doing no caffeine. This is day two, so I'm not doing pre-workout or BCAAs or anything. Like I'm staying away from all powders and stuff. So here we go to the gym. Can't wait. <laughs> and indeed there would be time But in the cold light I learned To love and adore you It's all that I am It's all that I have It's all that I have Yeah Yeah Blue jeans and ones and a white tee 06 hanging out the window like E High feet on one off a bottle might be my tree Smoking Agent Orange high C Back when me and Marty was recording at my mom's Most of y'all were chasing around bops I was in the lab only hoping that my job Never would be based around mops Now I'm on, yeah, she know Love me cause my ego Girls and the drugs always follow us when we go Hey, where the bay at? Shouts out to JM Looking for the party girls, let me know where they at Skinny rich girls always asking where the yay at Don't a house party like cool where you stay at turn upside down let her twerk on the wall took her to the bathroom and did work in the stall yeah hey guys hope you enjoyed a few of those clips y'all probably do the same exercises they're pretty close but you know whatever we're just some new ideas or anything i gotta go to grocery shop now um i would take you guys along but honestly, I just want to get in and get out. I want to be home. I've been gone for like two hours. I went so hard in the gym. So I'm going to go ahead, get that done. And then when I get home, I'll show you guys what all I get. So to the grocery store we go. Just got home. Hi. Jax, come here. Come say hi. I'm kind of trying to get like him acquainted with just going outside and hanging out makes me kind of nervous because I always think he's gonna like run away <laughs> what do you have that's a bone why is that outside hi pretty boy hi pretty boy let's go home I want to show you guys what I got from the grocery store so here you turd <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I got from the grocery store. I got, sorry if the dogs are barking. I got bagel thins. I like to do these for sandwiches, especially breakfast. I love these for breakfast. Some eggs, go figure. Vans waffles because my carbs are so high. I just kind of eat these pretty good macros for two waffles. I also got these, again, because my fats are super high now, so I got little holy guacamoles. I like to put them in like my um, rice bowls and stuff. I got a bunch of Carb Masters. These are my two go-to flavors. Blueberry muffin and vanilla. Good with fruit, good by itself. I got some bananas. Got a tomato. I love doing these on my breakfast sandwiches, just a little slice. Also got some shredded lettuce so I can make some chicken salads which leads me to chicken. It's a Simple Truth rotisserie chicken. This is like the best macro-friendly rotisserie chicken you can get there at Kroger. Also got two turkeys for deli meat. I give Jack some in his food. <laughs> and I also put these on my breakfast sandwiches or sandwich in general. 
Halo Top because this is my favorite flavor and Kroger didn't have the new flavors yet. Also got Carb Master Milk. Macros on this, zero fat, seven carbs, 11 protein per eight ounces. So you get a lot of milk and it's really good macros. Last but not least, well I got a few more things. Almond Breeze Milk, so I do this in my protein shakes or in my protein ice cream. So I just picked up some of that. I also got, I already ate one, these high fiber brownies from Kroger brand. 2.5 fat, 15 carb, two protein for each. They're pretty small, they're like this big, but still they're like a little lemon cake and they're good, they have five grams of fiber. Got some toaster pastries, some off brand. Uh, macros are the same as pop tarts, but I just have to fill my macros. So I kind of have to go for a little bit more processed food right now. I also got some, I can't believe it's not butter spray, like zero cows, kind of. Essentially, it's cooking spray. Um, and then I got a few of these packets. They're little granola, but I figured I'll take them this weekend when I travel again. It's a coconut macaroon and chocolate chunk granola. Six fat, six to eight fat, 25 to 27 carbs, and four to five protein per one. So just good to travel with and be able to track it. And lastly, I got some rice. I've been doing bulk rice cooking lately, so um, that's been helping me a lot. Oh, Jess, you wanna say hi? So that's all I got from the store. I got a lot to do today. I got some stuff to put on my Poshmark account. And just kinda like deep cleaning my room. I might be moving within the next couple months, so I need to have everything just kind of downsized. So. If y'all are interested, hit it. So, see you guys in a second. I just wanna talk about some things. Am I quitting social media? What am I doing? I have no clue. So we'll talk right. in a little. Okay, that was gross. I just got out of the shower. Chilling. And I'm about to deep clean this room. Wish me luck. All right, I just got done cleaning my room, I'm so tired. I did want to take a second to talk to you guys. So let's chat. So really there wasn't much that I wanted to like specifically say, I guess. I guess what's really just been bothering me lately is like, the environment on social media and I know that a lot of people can probably look at me and be like well like you put yourself in it like you're like it's your fault or like you're you know you could stop social media whatever but like that's so true however like social media has also brought me a lot of really great things along with like I run my business through social media so I'm not just gonna like give up on social media however I can say that I'm not gonna be a part of the environment that is it, that it's turning into just consistently see people crapping on others and like people especially on twitter that's like the really big app right now that's like taking a crap on life is everyone just feels the need to like be super freaking rude on that app and including instagram like like people are like putting themselves out there to be like vulnerable and stating their opinions or like posting a picture that maybe they were like not confident in but they did it and like wrote this beautiful caption and then you see these comments like you're fat or like reply back to them and put them on blast in front of public people like in front of the public and and that just like really hurts me to see because People are just trying to be themselves and where, not where, but like as a nation, as people, as humans, we're like crapping on them for it. That makes no sense. That's not nice. So I'm not gonna like keep rambling, but I do just have to say that like I am never going to partake in any sort of activity like that. Public harassment, it's terrible. I mean, it, it's what I just said, it's harassment. Like it's not nice and I know how it feels to be like made fun of and 
talked about and I would never do that to someone and I would hate for someone else to feel that way so stick with me fam and we're gonna be happy people <laughs> last thing sorry my hair is everywhere last thing that I just kind of wanted to tell you guys is I am leaving for Olympia next week. I'm super stoked. I've never been and it's just going to be a really good time to hang out with my friends and teammates along with just networking and meeting people. I'm super duper stoked. Um, one thing I wanted to tell you guys too is that I've had a few big girl interviews for really, really, really good jobs and so I'm not sure where I'm going to land yet but I might be moving. Um, I'm going to keep the area disclosed and not going to elaborate on these opportunities that I have right now um, due to it just being kind of up in the air and I'm not sure what I'm going to decide but but it's going to be really cool to follow through and see where this takes me so I'm really excited. Um, my fit guide is going amazing. I got quite a few girls in my challenge that starts September 10th my first ever eight week challenge and I'm super stoked my fit guide's still on sale um, it's $40 now but if you subscribe to my website you got a coupon for $5 off this is what it looks like so it's 31 pages everything that you could ever think of is on here all the workouts for eight weeks along with seven hit circuits, core circuits, and an exercise finder for each day. So it's a 31 page ebook. It's you're getting a lot of information for your money. It's really great. Your it's yours to keep, it's PDF. So that's gone really great. I also I don't have it in here, but I bought my first MacBook Pro. I'm super excited because I'm gonna be able to edit this video with iMovie I hope um, I've never used it so we'll see um, what else is new but still working full-time just got back from California yesterday my body is so confused <laughs> um, still eating over 400 grams of carbs a day like 70 some fats 140 protein so I'm eating almost about 3,000 calories a day um, BB Com spokesmodel search is in a couple months. I'm excited to go out for that. Um, I'm trying to think of if there's anything else to update you guys about. Still never wearing makeup. That's fine. I swear I'll look cute for you guys in one video. Uh, yeah, I guess that's kind of it. There's not much more to kind of update you guys about. Um, I guess I'm just continuing to do me and you know, continue on my walk with God and with my boyfriend. That's about it. Still flexing on him. Some big biceps. Whoa. Ah, I guess that's it. Yay! First vlog in like forever. Little Jaxie sleeping. You sleeping, honey? Knocked out like what are you doing that's all I got for you guys I hope you guys are having an awesome Labor Day sorry if this vlog was just kind of like bland I just wanted to update you guys on what's going on and just kind of leave it like that have a good day <sighs> hopefully if this edit goes good I'll be able to upload more vlogs that are more well put together but no promises we'll see so fingers crossed hey guys i will talk to you soon and thank you so much for tuning in yeah yeah blue jeans and ones and a white tee 06 hanging out the window like e high feet on one off a bottle might be my tree Smoke